So in this example, we're looking to select information um, specific to maybe a particular um, airport code. So if we look at here in StatCrunch and on this table, we have airport codes and it starts off with ATL and that stands, um, represents the Atlanta airport. So there should be 152 values there, but then we go further down and you see DTW for Detroit, we see EWR for New Jersey and FLL for Fort Lauderdale in Florida. So what if we wanna just extract information or select um, Detroit or Atlanta rather so that we can um, do some analysis. Um, so we have Atlanta here in row one, there's the airport and notice that it says from in June of 2003, um, right? There's 06, 2003, 06. The next month is July, August, September, June, July, August, September. And then that's all for that, uh, for that period, 2003, starting in June. And then it, you have the 12 months here starting in January 2004, going up through December 2004 and so forth. So we have this information. And if I wanted to, for example, extract um, just information on Atlanta, I'll go ahead and go into data and let's do row selection. And I'm going to say, let's select and right now there's nothing selected. There's, I just, you know, if I had already selected based on some search criteria, I could clear that if I wished. So I'm going to tell it to go ahead using the airport code. Let's add that column. And wherever in that airport code, we find a value, let's put the equals sign there, that equals ATL. Let's click add there. So where the airport code equals ATL, select those rows. So let's hit okay. Let's compute. And there are 152 rows selected. And we'll go all the way down here. And I think it stops just about here. Now it goes into Boston. So we have selected all rows. Um, that correspond to ATL or Atlanta.